Hot up Capricorn. Welcome to your lover's abyss reading for the month of December 2020. I am the Cosmic Divine Tarot and uh, Cappy. If you like this reading and you want to donate to my channel, then go ahead and hit that link in the description box below. Uh, to my cash app account and drop a sister off a couple dollars okay just a couple dollars and I greatly appreciate anything that you can give me Cappy okay Capricorn this is for your sun moon rising Venus Lilith sign now if it resonates with you then go ahead and hit that like share subscribe to the channel hit the bell notified to know when I will be uploading more of your messages Cappy now, if it does not resonate with you, then don't you worry about it because you know I'm just going to go ahead and get you next time, all right? Now, Capricorn, we are setting this bad boy off with the Barberry Zodiac Oracle to try to find the Zodiac sign you're dealing with, okay, who is a lover to you or wants to be a lover to you. So Capricorn, here is the first card. You have Uranus. Okay, now Uranus is talking about, looks like maybe somebody new is stepping on the scene. Because Uranus is all about new inventions, new people, new things that are happening. Someone who is more progressive, they're very smart, they're very intelligent, and they really know how to get the daggone job done. Uranus rules in Aquarius. So, this love of yours that's going to step on the scene or is on the scene already is going to be an aqua. Or, you also have fire here. This person is going to be a fire sign. Uh, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. And this person is just going to make you feel like you're going to be bathing in lava. Okay? They're going to make you feel so daggone hot and passionate that, you know, when you when you have sex with this person, you're going to feel that the whole house is melting and on fire. Okay? Now, you also have Venus here. Venus, the planet of love and beauty. Venus is the planet that rules Taurus. So, you have a Taurus there. That is very beautiful, very handsome person. And they're just all about love. They're going to love you. They're going to really be in love with you. Okay? Cappy. Now, this new person, who I hope this is a new person or somebody from your past that's stepping back on the scene that's going to be feeling like a new person. Okay, it's going to be described in this reading. But let's set it off again with the Romance Angels. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I got the romance angels for you, Cape. <laughs> this card, these cards came the day after yesterday, okay? I right, said, so let me go ahead and uh, do this reading for Capricorn with some romance angels too, alright? Yeah. Now, we're going to get a little bit more information about this person who I feel is a new person in your life. All right, Cappy? Now, let me get you one more shuffle. All right, let's see, y'all. Family, what messages do we have for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Lilith? All right. Wake up, y'all. Wake up. What messages do we have for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Lilith? Hmm. I keep missing your card, Cappy. Let's go slow here. What messages do we have for... All right. Flirt. <laughs> okay, Cappy. Extend your lighthearted energy to others. Now, you see this person over here on trying to warm up to you. But you're sitting up there looking away from this person. Like, you know, you don't feel like being bothered. Because maybe you just feel like you had something crazy that happened to you in the past from the ex. But this person wants you to go ahead and open up. So extend your lighthearted uh, energy to others. Be flirtatious, Capricorn. Be flirtatious. Or maybe that's you sliding up to somebody else. Like, what's up, baby? How you doing? How you feeling today? 
looking all fly over here with your with your white dress on looking all sexy and everything okay getting to know each other what i tell you capricorn you gonna meet somebody new okay now it says as you reveal your innermost selves to each other your bond deepens okay your bond deepens so Capricorn, you're going to meet somebody who you're going to have to be open and flirty with, uh, not closed off, not shut off, okay? And this person uh, is going to be flirting with you, okay? <laughs> They're going to be flirting with you, baby. Now, I got another deck for you called the Casanova Tarot, okay, Cappy? Yeah, this is the Casanova Tarot. Mm hmm <laughs> Let's see what. Let's see this person. This person, the Casanova Capricorn. <laughs> Is this person going to make you feel like they're a Casa Dagon Nova? Mm -mm -mm. Let me see. <laughs> Capricorn. All right, Cappy. How you doing, Capricorn? You doing all right today? You feeling all right today, baby? <clears throat> go ahead and get you one more shuffle and see what the heck is going on with this new person who is so progressive so smart and intelligent and so passionate beautiful handsome and loving let me go ahead and cut this deck let's go ahead and get capricorn some messages all right okay cut back <clears throat> now what messages do we have for capricorn Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Lilith. All right, Capricorn. Here is the Six of Chalices. Now, the Six of Chalices. You see this this person right here. All right. Now, it could be when this person comes into your life that there's somebody from the past that remembers you. They remember what it was like to be with you. Capricorn, okay, they remember when you two were together, remember how sexy and beautiful you were right here, okay, to them. They remember y'all kissing and y'all great romance, all right, this person is very nostalgic about you, okay. This person remembers you, they remember you and they love you, but you're going to have to uh, take the time to get to know this person and flirt with them because it's been a long time since y'all can have been in contact. What other messages do we have for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Lilith? All right, let's see, Cappy. Ooh, three of chalices. Okay, Capricorn. Now, you see somebody in the bed with somebody else here, but somebody else on the side right here underneath the covers giving him oral sex. Well, you know, that tells me that this person... Y'all broke up in the past because there was a third party or maybe you went ahead and left this person for you, the dude who is your ex now, okay? But this person has memories about you and this could also be saying like when it says to getting to know each other and as you reveal your uh, innermost selves. To each other you could be talking to this person about your ex having a third party about uh your ex being in the bed booty butt naked with somebody else and doing things that they didn't have no damn business doing so it could be that you two are talking to each other like that you two are you know catching up and you're telling them that you just got out of a relationship where you were cheated on capricorn all right what other messages do we have for Cappy? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Okay. Yeah, and and how you had to go ahead and hold back from your from your ex. Okay, so it's it's like 
you you still feel some type of way about what happened between your ex and this crazy ass third party capricorn and you're talking to this new person that is in your life about uh all of this you know y'all are laying on the bed and y'all not necessarily having sex with each other but you do have your boobies out you do have your chest out but you have the covers on and you're just laying on this person's lap and you're telling them how you were hurt in the past okay how you were hurt in the past and you know how you felt and how you had to hold back love from this other person how you had to go ahead and leave them with the six of swords or how they left you for this other person that's in the car with them all right so you, you're telling this person all these things you you have to reveal you're going to have to open up and and uh let them know what exactly happened with you okay with this uh king of wands who you were dealing with king of wands right here somebody who just brought in other people who wound up you know being some type of witch or warlock putting all kind of spells on them to come after you okay and do harm to you capricorn here we go here we go here we go baby here we go yeah that's who she is this is who you're talking to them about this person right here this person right here who did spell work on your ex and also how your person did spell work on you. So you're going to have to talk. You're going to be talking to this person, not have to, but you're going to feel comfortable enough to talk to this person uh, from your past who you uh, used to be in a relationship with or maybe y'all didn't get into a relationship with each other but this person is back and wanted to be in a relationship with you but you're going to be talking about how these people did spell work as you can see the queen of chalices is here she has her legs open she's uh naked and there's a cup down in between her legs okay so there's something there's like there's something that happened to your ex from this third party all right third party did something okay and here is the uh the nine of of uh, chalices here. It's the nine of chalices. You can see somebody's uh, bent over, uh, booty out, and giving somebody else oral sex. Okay, so Capricorn, while you up there talking to this person about all of your problems that you have encountered with your crazy ass ex, you wanna find uh, that <laughs> you have them. <laughs> No, that no, they have you laying on your lap right now, but you got the covers over your uh your wand and or your kitty. And next thing you know, this person gonna be down there in between your legs, uh, pleasuring you orally, trying to make you feel better. You're going to you're not even going to believe how good you're gonna feel from this person uh doing that. That's a cancer Pisces uh Scorpio. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they're going to be down there in between your legs making you feel like uh, you on cloud 999, okay? Cap A, yeah. So while you're up there bearing your heart and crying and everything and, and, uh, and uh, you know, feeling like you just um, was uh, so betrayed by, by your ex, this person going to be making you feel good. Now, here's the, the nine of... Uh, so it's here. This person, this new person stepping on the scene is then going to go ahead and do the nine of swords with you, baby. Not give you any kind of rest that night. They're going to show you the real king of wands. Okay? They're going to show you the real king of wands. Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. Like I said, this person is going to have so much passion for you. Okay? They want to bring you out of this dark period with the hermit right here. This is the hermit right here. This is what you were before this person stepped on the scene, Cappy. Hold on, baby. I got something in my throat, Cappy. Yeah, they, they're going to show you the light. <laughs> They're going to show you the light, Capricorn. They're going to show you what love really is and how they don't have to resort to no daggone magic work or no spells to make you feel that you can come out of this dark period. 
this dark time that you've been with this crazy ass ex and the third party okay so that's basically what's going to happen uh capricorn or if it's not happening right now it's going to happen soon all right now uh, like i said you're going to be getting to know each other and uh this person is going to really want to get to know you by going down there and tasting the cookie okay tasting everything you got down there just making you feel real good and to the point where y'all going to be at it all night long y'all going to just be having sex all night long he going to have have his hand down there feeling all up on your kitty okay all night long whispering in your ear breathing on your neck squeezing on your breast oh yeah Oh yeah, Capricorn, it's going to get really, really hot. Really, really hot with you and this person and how you were crying and, and, and feeling so upset and, and, and feeling so lost about the spell that your ex put on you and you know how you just feel so betrayed by your ex. Oh, this person is going to make you feel like you have just entered uh, another whole different world, baby. Because they're going to be flirting with you the whole daggone time, Capricorn. They're going to be flirting with you, so it's not going to be so much of a of a surprise that this person is going to be all in between your legs while you up there with tears in your eyes. You know, it's not going to be too much of a surprise because they're going to be uh, flirting with you the whole time, baby. Let me get you one more shuffle. That's the Love Oracle cards. <clears throat> okay, Capi. What messages do we have for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus? It says meditate. Meditate. Meditate daily. Follow your intuition. Find inner peace, balance, alone or with a partner. So this person is going to be giving you oral sex so good. You're going to find an inner peace and balance. When this person is having, making love to you all night long and all feeling all up and down on your body like you need to be felt up and down on your body, you're going to uh, listen to your intuition telling you that this person is the one. Okay? Yeah, you're going to be listening to your intuition tell you that this person is the one you've been waiting for, Capricorn. Okay, now what other messages do we have for Cafe? <laughs> Look like you in the lotus position right here. And this person going to go ahead and and uh, make you feel really good. Okay, make you feel really good. Oh, come on, y'all. Okay, rewrite your story. So this person is going to be whispering in your ear the things that you need to hear to rewrite your love story, Capricorn. They're going to be telling you all kind of things like how sexy you are, how beautiful you are, how much they missed you, how much they've been thinking about you, how much is the six of uh, chalices here, how much they have... Uh, you know, just had so much fond memories of you in the past and how they could never get you off their mind and how much they love you and how much they've been wanting to come back towards you with the six of uh, swords here and go ahead and taste in between your legs, okay? That's what this person going to be telling you. Yeah, they're going to rewrite the story to how they wanted it to be in the past with them before you even met your ex. I'm feeling like this person was interested in you before you even got into a relationship with that crazy ex. Okay? What other messages do we have for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus? Communication. What was I telling you? What was I telling you? Communication, Cappy. Yeah, they're going to be communicating to you. They're going to be addressing concerns. They're going to be addressing your concerns without a, without you feeling attacked. Okay? And, you know, communication was the issue last time. This person is going to have a loving dialogue with you. Because if they would have let you know that they had these feelings for you, Capricorn, then you wouldn't have even went ahead and been with the ex, baby. You wouldn't even have been with the ex. This person going to feel 
like a abandonment. Okay, you wouldn't even have been with the ex no who you felt abandoned by. Okay, abandoned fear of abandonment issues are affecting the relationship. Ghosting, forgive yourself. That's what they're going to be telling you, Capricorn. Forgive yourself for allowing this person into your life anyway. Forgive yourself, baby. Okay, don't even don't even think about that ex no more. Oh, yeah, don't even think about that ex no more who cheated on you and abandoned you. They're going to tell you don't even think about that ex no more. Don't even think about being triggered uh, or, you know, having trust issues. They're going to help you heal the past, Capricorn. That's what they're going to do. Because you was cheated on by your ex. This person want to step on the scene and help you heal your heart. Heal from everything that's happened in the past. Bring you out of this dark period where people were performing all types of uh, magic on you. Mm, Capricorn. Yeah, this person is somebody who's going to come into your life and just make you feel like you just need to feel right now, Cappy. Okay. And they're going to be a good choice. They're going to be a good choice for you. You're going to rely upon your intuition, your ancestors, the universe is going to tell you why this person is making love to you all night long. Why this person is making love to you all night long and flirting with you and getting to know you, okay? And flirting, like I said, getting to know you and flirting with you. Uh, they're going to be getting to know you real good and you're going to be getting to know this person real good. And like I said, the universe and everything is going to be in union with you two being together. You're not going to have any doubts about this person doing any type of craziness or stepping out on you or anything like that, Capricorn. Okay? This is a new person or somebody from your past. This is somebody from your past who's going to feel like a new person. <laughs> okay, Capi? All right, now, if this reading resonates with you, then go ahead and uh, hit that like, share, subscribe to the channel. Hit the bell notifier to know that we'll be uploading more of your messages, Capricorn. Now, if it doesn't resonate with you, then don't even worry about that, baby, because I'm just going to, yeah, like I said, get you next time, okay? Capricorn, thank you for watching the video today, and you have a great day, my darling. Peace, love, and light. Hold up.